guys, it's Lisette here. Today's agenda is to clean my whole place. So, place is looking questionably crazy. I don't like when my place gets like this. It really just like mentally drags me down. It makes me feel like I can't be productive. So if you like videos like this and you want to just watch me clean my place, then let's get started. I actually went to Target and I bought like a bunch of cleaning supplies. This isn't the only bag. I got like literally three bags worth of cleaning supplies. So I am ready. filled with like random things I've learned from TikTok like cleaning. I learned that you can take your sponges and put them in your dishwasher and that keeps them clean. Like maybe that's literally common sense but I never knew so just in case you don't know I thought that was kind of interesting. I have to put on different gloves because these nails are like sharp and it's just going right through them so I'm gonna put on some thicker gloves. This is kind of weird. I don't know if it's just me, but like I've always had this really weird fear of like getting too close to my oven, like inside. So even like spraying to clean my oven is kind of like freaking me out. I don't know, maybe I'm just being weird. You know, I've never actually cleaned an oven before. This is like my first time. So I don't have any like oven cleaner, but maybe that would make this process a little bit easier. off of TikTok and it's how to properly clean your sink. You're just gonna need baking soda and vinegar. Got my gloves on. Take this piece out of your sink. That is disgusting. Whoa. You wanna take your baking soda, pour it all down the drain, and then you wanna take your vinegar. Then you want to put a bunch of dish soap around your water and put on the disposal this is a way to make sure that your sink doesn't smell just quick tip that like it was light when I started and it's literally nighttime. But I wanna show you guys the dirt because that's obviously the best part. This is what was pulled out of all my furniture. And so, yeah.
this is called the chom chom and it's pretty cool because the hair goes in here. So you just kind of go back and forth. All right, so you can see all the hair that I collected. So this is kind of like an eco-friendly way to remove hair. So I also ordered this Bissell Crosswave, which is supposed to like vacuum and mop your floors at the same time. We're gonna just see like if this works or not. this water this water is literally black that's disgusting the pool ah, I don't want to break it Ooh. I mean honestly it seems like a lot of like cleaning because you have to clean each piece to keep it like you know hair free dirt free this piece just take it out and then you just let it dry right here. Hello, bubbies. How are you, baby? You are just so handsome. I finally washed these covers, and so now I just gotta put them back on all the pillows. Hey guys, so today is day two. Got a little overexcited, thinking I could do everything in one day. I was so freaking tired after yesterday. I was cleaning for like, I don't know, seven, eight hours. Got my energy drink. Today, I'm gonna tackle my room, and I'm gonna tackle the bathroom. I don't feel like this is gonna be too bad because I feel like my room has looked worse. It's definitely looked worse. It's really just a lot of clothes and a lot of like miscellaneous things that just need to be put away vacuum and i also have some new bedding that i'm gonna put on which i'm really excited about because it's gonna make my room look like a little bit more expensive bathroom's gonna be a little bit more like cleaning cleaning this is more of like organizing so it's a little bit easier like why do i need this these old nipple covers why So I got my piles going. I have stuff to hang up in the closet. These are like sweats, tees, sleepwear, underwear, and kind of like towels and stuff. When I moved here and they transported this, the drawers got like all wonky and they never like I thought I could fix it but I've never like been able to get it back to normal so I just feel like this got damaged in the move and I feel like it might be time for me to get a new dresser
decided it was time for some new bedding because my old bedding just looks exactly what I said. It looks old. This is what the comforter looks like. It's white. It has like this pearl sheen to it, which is really pretty. So I got this from Z Gallery. I also got the matching shams. And I got these sheets just from like Amazon because, you know, I don't want to spend a bunch of money on sheets. This was delivered yesterday, but I just washed it because, you know, you don't want to just put it on your bed right after you receive it in the mail because you never know. fitted sheet i could have sworn that my bed is a full size i do not think i have a queen size and i bought a full size sheet this barely fit so i probably should have upsized but 20 minutes later made it work this is actually what matters though no one's really gonna see that Side note, if you have curly hair, you can replace your drains with these like little stoppers and it literally like collects all the hair in here. And so that way you don't clog your drains because I was clogging my drains low key like <laughs> every week. <laughs> This looks like pee, but it's just the bleach mixing with the gel. It was not like that before. <laughs> Random fun fact, every time you flush your toilet, stuff like sprays out into the air. So always make sure you keep this closed. Now, onto the shower.
So, <clears throat> little bleachy smelling in here. I have my window open. I am almost done with the bathroom. I am literally so excited. You have no idea. Like, I am tired. done cleaning I'm so happy I feel so much better um, obviously Paris loves my new bed all I know is that I just want to take a really hot shower and eat some pizza and go to sleep <laughs> if you like videos like this and you want more vlogs from me then please make sure to give me a big thumbs up you already know subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and also follow me on Instagram at Lisette and I'll see you guys in my next video bye <laughs>